The restoration shop here at the Remington is, is kind of unique in the museum world in that our facility is available for public viewing. We have a viewing gallery and we do demonstrations and people can come and watch the vehicles being restored. We have a functioning coal-fired forge. I have a piece of metal in there that I'm going to heat up. So we use our forge here to uh, repair and fabricate parts for the restorations that we're doing. This is called a power hammer or a trip hammer. My co-worker has described it as a sledgehammer with a gas pedal. So a good blacksmith is able to control many different properties in his metal in the fire by the amount of oxygen he's forcing through, by the type and quantity of the coal that he's using. This is an image taken from the uh, Studebaker Brothers catalog from the early 1900s. It's an engraving showing the inside of their blacksmith shop in their wagon factory. But each one of these hoods in a row down here represents an individual forge like what we have going here. There's probably close to a hundred blacksmiths working in this department at Studebaker Brothers. The noise and the heat must have been incredible.